before you is Martina, a local Santa Cruz artist. Martina? Yeah, thanks, Richard. Yes, I have been doing these magical, whimsical pieces of art ever since early childhood. They've been refined over the years to be these very beautiful, very detailed pieces of art. Most of them are done on regular, beautiful pieces of paper with a black outline, and then I use these high quality art markers to fill them in. Um, I've been working all of 2010 on this particular series called The Alchemy of Love, which shows um, masculine and feminine energies intermingling with each other in a way that is harmonious, conscious, avant-garde, showing the way into what true, deep, meaningful relationships really can be on this planet. And I am here Wonderful. To, Maybe yeah, you can also uh, show us some of the art the, that's... Uh, Hindu is the deity, half Shiva, half Parvati. And it uh, is just my own interpretation of that particular uh, deity. Okay. Um, it's one of the most unusual ones. The 17 pieces in the Alchemy of Love series, actually most of them have two individuals kind of in harmonious interaction, either healing, serving, or supporting each other in some magical way. Okay. So this is one of the, the and, odd pieces. And over here we have this some more. This one is uh, called The Call for Transformation. It is a piece that shows um, shows these two beings kind of interwoven here as a butterfly on their head showing their telepathetic telepathic telepathic, I telepathic got it. Um, okay. union and also calling in through the conscious um, the the they conscious come in different sizes size. as you can see and they wow, can be ordered that way uh, this size 10 by 12 14 by 17 and then the big one that you just saw 28 by 34 inches Mm -hmm. And um, this particular piece here, I really loved creating it. It's called The Initiation into the Heart of Manhood. Ooh, it's, it's like a rite of passage, isn't yes, it? Yes, it seems to depict this, this beautiful priestess who, who is blessing and um, initiating this warrior of light into, into his next phase of um, serving, serving in more strength. Wow. Oh. Yes. Yep. This particular piece here I call Mermaids Spooning. It was the first one of that particular series. So it's very sweet. Um, a lot of times they, people say they remind them of Aztec or Mayan uh, faces just because the way their nose is curved oftentimes have this indigenous um, feel to them. Uh -huh. um, and they're just dreaming the same dream again. They're, they're kind of interwoven, interconnected with each other. Just really so nicely. This particular piece is um, called uh, My Valentine. Valentine. It's a very like cute, whimsical life. picture of two people really in love with each other, and you could see that. And he's kind of hiding that little flower behind his back, ready to give that to his beloved. Um, so this piece is for sale. You can see it has like a half-inch foam board. It's very light. It has these strips in the back, which kind of create an offset on the wall here. So that looks. Oh yeah, I see what you mean. Yeah, it looks so very it nice. So it has a nice. Uh, offset look with the shadow around the portrait mm -hmm. versus, say, the mm -hmm. flat foam board mounted. Yeah, these ones come flat. These are the smaller pieces. against the wall. Uh -huh. Yes. And I also sell them. They come in these little sleeves here and very easy to ship and to mm -hmm. handle. I also have this other uh, series that I've been working on over the last five years. And uh, in, in this particular series, there's always the Earth Gaia, Mother Earth is the focal point where um, she, Mother Earth obviously is in distress right now. And so these creatures of light come here to playfully remind us that we have a duty to, to help serve this planet in all these different ways. So there's one here where this monk is meditating on Earth and uh, bringing peace and light. Mm -hmm. Another one is, which I love, um, this being here doing acupuncture on planet Earth so that we can activate we her health and uh, regenerate. I can be reached. My phone number is area code 831-818-1088. Yeah, and my uh, email is mar oshanamartina at yahoo.com. Thank you. It's not, but it's... <laughs> Good. Thank <laughs> you.